watch and burn. Hey everyone, so tonight I wanted to discuss Cobra Killer's record, Cobra Killer's self-titled record that they did for DHR way back when. Now, this is a tough one to sort of talk about here because Cobra Killer was uh, half of a cater. It was Gina from a cater with Anika. And Anika, of course, was not in a cater. It was Patrick C. and Gina that were in a cater. So this is half of a cater here. So you would assume that you know what you're getting yourself into, but your assumptions would be way wrong because what this is is sort of like a 1970s sort of kaleidoscope-inspired sample-heavy chopped-to-fuck oddly timed vocals, definitely weird time signatures, sort of tribute to music and times past that sounds really, really current and yet completely retro at the same time. And this record is all over the place. I mean, I will say uh, Merry Go Round is on here and it's one of my favorite songs that uh, anybody from the DHR camp have ever written and recorded and released. I love that song. I'm not entirely sure. Entertain the Dinosaur. I think that's what it's saying, at least. I don't know. Is there lyrics in here? Oh, there are lyrics in here. Look at that. Going on the merry-go-round. Yeah, but not really. There are lyrics, but I can't seem to find the lyrics for merry-go-round. So I'm going to leave it with that line that I don't get is definitely entertain the dinosaur. Right or wrong. But I think the booklet for this does a really good job of encapsulating exactly how the music sounds. Like you just kind of turned any page. That's how the record sounds. It's sort of this like patchwork sort of collage of a million different types of music, all sort of Frankenstein together. And every track on here is mid-paced and more subdued than anything Ekater has ever done. So again, like I said, your assumptions that, oh, it's the chick from Ekater, so I know what I'm getting myself. And you don't. You have no idea what this record's going to sound like. This is a more quieter, more like almost at times you could argue like a mainstream focused sample heavy record, which is nice because Ekater and Patrick C, he's done a number of things that didn't exactly fit the Ekater mold older older either, much like uh, Flex Busterman. So when you get to see the other half of Akater do something completely similar, and yet at the same time, a complete departure from anything Patrick C. has done, this is 100% original, and this is Gina, and whoever Anika is, completely doing their own thing. And it comes through, and it works really well. This record is really, really weird. And it's like I said, it's sort of like a collage of, of various drum loops, bass loops, synth loops, and like it's a complete tribute to the 70s in a lot of way, in a lot of ways, sorry. But at the same time, it does sound really modern. And this is a weird one to wrap your head around. I can't exactly label this all that well, but I will say the record is fun, the songs are catchy, and it's an easy listen. Or it's a hard listen, depending on what you're looking for, because this is definitely not something DHR was known for. So this will sort of divide the DHR fan base. But I really liked it. I liked everything about it. I loved the I loved the production. I loved the samples. I loved the drums. I loved the bass lines. I loved the design of the album. I loved the artwork. I loved the collage element. Sort of has like a Lolita Storm thing going on. It was a lot of fun. So, yeah, I'm going to go. So thank you so much hanging out with me while I discussed Cobra Killer's self-titled release on DHR from way back when. If you like this review, don't forget to do something nice for somebody. You guys are amazing, and I will talk to you soon. Have a good night. I just wanted to say thank you for making it through the entire video. I really appreciate it. And I'm going to remind everyone one more time, even though I've probably already done this in the video that you just watched, to please click the like button as well as the subscribe button because it helps this channel grow. And thank you for hitting like and subscribe. And we will see you guys really soon.